today I want to see you sharp and quick. That could be dangerous if used properly. Catch somebody off guard. Just be like, yeah. Beautiful combination. Keep it up. Put the pressure on it. I don't know if that's a beautiful combination. I'm just throwing my toes in his face. Next opponent is going to be no. No what, coach? What will he be no of? Good. Now I have to also remember to fucking apply perks. <laughs> Forgot I don't have a perk on. Use my points to get myself one. Damn right, low stamina makes it harder to finish. I don't... I don't know what that's gonna mean, but I, I, it's hard to finish when you don't have stamina. So I have crafty, improved submission defense in bottom position. Gave me. Uh, use less stamina when grappling on the feet. Kicks. Okay, I... Has what it takes to be in the UFC. I can see it. Thank you, Sugar Bob. Ground grapples. Improved submission defense and top. Use less stamina while grappling on the ground. I might use just because I'm going to be on the ground. Uh, able to get up more easily. I think I'm going to get this. Workhorse. And I'm going to switch this one to... Uh, get marathon or actions consume less stamina when moving because I'm moving around and doing all that shit but I think I'm gonna get uh I'm gonna get able to get to my feet better uh just because if uh, someone is amazing at ground I want to be able to try to get back to my feet just to get off the ground more easily looking forward to it we're gonna have a heck of a fight Eventually, we're going to get cocky, because I'm not going to give a shit about any of these people. Just me kicking that man in the face. Training's going great. whoop -a. You're going to see them around town. All right, sure, this will improve my hooks. I should really read the challenges, but I'm just like, oh, this will help everything I like using. All right, some sweet science. Let's go. Excellent blocking. Yep, I'm throwing. I'm keeping at a safe distance from a boxer, as you can tell. Yeah, you like that? I can throw that kick now. Yes, those punches are adding up. See? I was gonna say those are safe. That's the way you master your craft. You got thirty. Let's go. Nice punch. Nice punch. You felt that one. Hey, you see those hooks flying? We're working on them. Kind of throw, start trying to throw some uppercuts in every once in a while. Better than last time, and it'll be better next time. I drew the awkward-looking hair. Hey, my hair is amazing. All right, R Dick Ryder always with the mullet, <laughs> and how it moves around awkwardly when. Every motion is being made. Unless we're talking about his body hair, then... Look, man, not everyone's perfect with the way they grow their body hair.
Oh, so that's just him. He didn't ask for this. This is just how he grew up. <laughs> How do you think school was for him? He's already giving mustache rides to people's dads at the sweet age of 16. Ugh, never mind. Watch out, you're getting our triangle. Believe me, I've been working on my ground game since we started over. Getting slightly better at the ground game, but I know once we go against like actual UFC fighters, like in the top 15, they're just gonna throw me and fucking beat my ass. But you know what? At least I'm slightly better than the last time I tried, where they, uh, where I just panicked the entire time. Like, I don't mind the way we have to do this, but I did, like, three for the short bit that I played where it was just hit the X and you would just increase slowly but surely your stats. This it was just skip all just of this. See heavy <laughs> Let it go. Okay, okay. Good combination work. Oh my god, I'm seeing stars. Come on, man. Not so rough. opponent is going to be no match for you. Hey, you like that? Look at that. That fucking move. You're lucky. I was trying to go for another takedown. I'm learning the takedowns in the clinch. Work with your hands. Yeah, you're starting to fall apart. I love it. Excellent I'm getting there. Better than... Better than who? Better than what? Coach, you can't leave me hanging. But now I have a fucking injury. I'm seeing stars. Since we changed our weight class, I miss Curtis, because I would just kill him. <laughs> over and over. Yeah, yeah, I suffered an injury. I don't have the money to pay for a 5000 fucking dollar. Like, why is it $2,000 to see my mom? <laughs> Land clinch punches. Okay, I think I could do that. 
EK's probably been all about that sweet Final Fantasy online. Time to I don't know why I mentioned it. I just I keep seeing fucking commercials about it now. Nice work in there. Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Thanks for the false vote of confidence. Oh my god. Yeah, look at those front nice, kicks. Nice kickboxing, okay? Keep building up that damage. Let's go. Oh, I only said it because I was like, I saw a commercial and it's all I've been getting ads about. And I'm like, I'd like to try to get into it, but I just don't have the money for that kind of stuff. For like, subscription-based things. MMORPGs and things. I can't do it. Look at that takedown. Work. It was alright too for the little bit that I played for like a free trial thing or like the free whatever they had for a while on PlayStation. I don't know, I have a hard time with MMOs. Like I have fun with them, but I just can't quite get into them. Depending on which one it is. Like the last one I even got into was WoW, but that was mostly because me and my dad used to play that. I was a two and a half star, but her. But now I'm two star because I got hurt, and I think some of my stats went down. All right, let's go. Oops. No. Oh, I'm overtrained. If my next opponent was a heavy bag. Ah, oh, so tired. I don't I don't know if any of that was good for I'm also heavily overtrained. I'm going to be fucked going into this next one. What do you mean? I also have no eyebrows too, because when we remade the character I decided he shouldn't have eyebrows, so now he just kinda has this look of like confusion. Constantly doesn't look he either looks angry, dumbfounded, or just is unsure what the fuck or like why. He looks like he was on his way to Burger King. And he somehow became an MMA, MMA fighter, and he doesn't know why or how this happened. We're a two and a half star again because we improved and we are overtrained for this next week. Good. Against fucking Mr. Ten and One.
Me to die. We're also just starting off on hard instead of playing on normal and turning it to hard difficulty right as we got to the top 15, which fucked me up horribly. But man, there are some amazing people in our weight class in the USC that I can't wait to get destroyed by. Dude, I got a huge reach advantage. This dude's short. Dude, I have a better reach. Come over here. You can't break your will. I haven't tried. want any of this. You like that? You want to get the fucking clinch? Believe me, I've improved. Kind of. Dude, this guy's dancing around me. I should have watched tape on him. Uh-oh. Oh, that's gonna make me... Gonna fuck me up. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> you know what? I'll take that loss. I'll fucking take that loss. <laughs> Holy cow. He fucking ruined me. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gone. Well, I guess that's the end of my career. <laughs> Oh man, what a fucking kick. Smart guy, hasn't thrown that move out at all through that fight. Pulls that out of his ass and destroyed me. Holy shit. Let's watch it again, where I went for a kick, missed, and he danced around my kick. It was over. <laughs> Just, nope, nothing. Oh my god, that is a thing of beauty. I don't even care. I'm not upset at all. That dude landed like that was the perfect shot to just destroy me. I should have looked. He's probably like a boxer or a kickboxer, of course, with that kick. Because I'm like, I should have just taken him to the ground. Maybe I would have had luck trying to submit him. His fucking kicks and punches hurt like a motherfucker. We're in this thing to get to the top. Make our mark and get out. Turning down fights. Uh, and get out. Turning down fights and taking too much damage is going to keep you from getting there. Something to be aware of. I got it. You'll see a difference from now on. Maybe I shouldn't have overtrained. I also have a concussion. So, I will be out of fighting for 270 days. Uh huh. My attributes are down. Oh, this man's handsome. <laughs> Where was DK to back me up? <laughs>
Holy cow, that fucking kick. Of course that kick took me out for 200 some days. Fucking destroyed my ass. Holy cow. Heavy punches. You ready? Some progress. Gonna take it light, train, use the heavy bag, don't get injured in my fighting, get my points back and try to repair what was damaged through the concussion. Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. said my opponent would be no match for me last time and look what happened. He put me out of commission for 270 days. I can't even fathom how long that actually is because I don't know math. Or my days. You know, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I got kicked in the skull. Let me at him. Let me at him. Dude fucking almost ended my career before it even started. I'm training to beat everyone. How's that going for you? Alright, let's look at who we're up against. He's a one star and he likes to be a boxer, so my best bet, get him on the ground. I think. Again, you would think that would be the, the smart move, but I'll probably get destroyed. I, and it was funny, I'm like, I got a reach advantage, this guy's small. Well, it didn't work out so great for me. Drill, drill, drill. Why? Because repetition is the mother of all skill. That's why. Let's go. Nice level change there, just like that. We're getting a fucking side side. You like this? Nice level change there, just like that. Nice. Uh oh. Uh oh. The choke. The choke. The rear naked choke. You may think I'm choking him, but you may be thinking something else is going on, you dirty, go. dirty Show people. <laughs> I'm pulling his pants down. Here to work. Let's go. Oh, that was good. Strong takedown. Yeah. I love the way you attacked those legs and got on top. I mean, I didn't. I'm on the bottom now, but you know, I I was at the top. Started from the top and ended up on the bottom. I don't think that's how the song goes, Coach. Started at the bottom and I dug a hole. Like, wait a minute. Hold on a sec. All right, what was damaged in my concussion? Because I'm now a two st Yup, my accuracy went down, no shit. I'm like, I can't punch good. Anything else get broken? Oh, oh, oh yup, my chin shrank. This is horribly ruined. No shit, my chin strength was gone from that. I don't even think I have a chin anymore after what just happened to me. Or a neck.
And even after that concussion and everything, I only have three weeks of training for this bout. Like, I did, what a crazy man. He's going to train for only three weeks and go back into a fight after what happened to him. That's where we want to be. I think he'd want more time. Let's hit the mats and work till we get there. Man, your next opponent is going to be no match for you. Yep, nice. Let's see another. Oh, those wrestling takedown. Come on. Are you not impressed? I just keep eating punches. Very smooth. Look at that. That's beautiful right there. And we put him in north south. Go. Drive him through the sky. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? Uh oh. Uh oh. You gotta watch out. I could get you in a submission from any position. Not that I'm ever that good at this fucking version. When we wore him out, he was tired. He tried to transition, got himself exhausted. We got him in submission territory. What I thought. Look at that ground game. What are you gonna do when this dad bot smothers you? You're not fucking moving. Should've just trusted my ground game against that last guy who concussed me. He broke my head and neck. What I get for uh, not watching the tape on the guy I was about to. He was probably a kickboxer. That's why, even though I, I went in with confidence of my reach being way better than him, he killed me. Oh. Yeah, look at those punches of the body. Coming along really well. Yo, know those elbows. Show with that this heavy bag. Does not know who he's fucking with with these elbows. We took a loss. We got a concussion, but we're coming back stronger, better than before. Your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Remember, repetition is key. And it always pays off. So let's go. You got Look at this. Seconds. Yeah, let me just go into the octagon and get the heavy bag. I'll fucking win in his unlimited stamina. I'm gonna get fucking killed again, aren't I? I mean, this guy's shit who we're up against, but... I don't think that means anything to me. I'm shit. I don't know, my takedowns and my clinch abilities have improved a little bit now that I'm learning the controls a tad bit. I'm almost a three-star fighter. And I've recovered all of my missing stats from my injury. Which, come to think of it, now that I've, I thought about it, I don't think I recovered anything that was injured on my last guy when I got to the USC. I think whatever was hurt just stayed damaged. But, you know, it was that. So I kind of just went in probably into the UFC. Pretty much a broken, like, shell of one of my old self. shadow of my former self.
Champ, champ, champ. Dude, I'll die if I get to UFC. The people that are in this uh, weight class. Everybody who knows UFC knows one of the toughest SOBs that I'll have to face in the light heavyweight division. Oh, look, I have a reach advantage. Like, that mattered for me last time. You ready? You ready? So, guys, oh, what are you going to do? Yep, keep punching me. Wear yourself out. What are you going to do? No, you're not moving. Uh-oh. You're in trouble now. Triangle choke. Take a couple blows, that's fine. Get myself back into side control. Oh god, his hand. A little worn out, I'll have to take a couple shots to the, to the dome. Missing the shot. Oh, try to give him a little of that little foot rub. rocked me there but you know what I think I had a little bit of a better better go around than he did I don't I couldn't tell you but good good slam there in that one point when we had him rocked Get off of me. The clinch hasn't worked for you now. It's not going to work for you then. What are you going to do? Ooh, ooh.
Luckily, I don't know how to do any sort of like suplex on the backside. You would have been so doomed. You would have been effed. That's what I thought. You can't avoid me forever. You should have been easier than that, but you know what? I was practicing a lot of things. It was a hell of a fight. We're putting up some interesting fights. Early game, or the early start we were doing okay. I mean, there's just no way I was going to tap him. I feel like submission was a hell of a lot easier in the third, but their way of doing it was a little bit easier to deal with that, or you can put easy submission on, just tap X and you'd win. But in this one, move around a bit. They're not great at tapping you out, but... Good at getting out of it. Wonder Boy Thompson. No one, why is no one like my fat ass? Wow, great opportunity to go to that contender series. <laughs> Invite to Dana White's contender series dick. Wait a minute. <laughs> Love when the phone rings to some good news. You got an invite to Dana White's Contender Series Dick. I'm glad that my name's Dick. I wonder what the secret... It's just like... It should have been like... I don't know. <laughs> it's love when the phone rings. Some good news. You got an invite to Dana White's Contender Series Dick. Like, now... Coach, you need to explain to me in great detail what that in includes. I would love to, but you know what? I'm going to wait just a little longer. I'm having a little bit of a rough time still in just WFA. So I want to I wanna continue to harness my, my skill. I could be making way more money and fighting a hell of a lot of people, but a hell of a lot of different things. But you know what? I think I'm, I'm going to stick with WFA for just a little longer. Oh, someone tweeted and I didn't see it. Oh god, this guy again. He killed me with that kick. But you know what? I should decline it. But I'm interested in seeing if I can have a redemption arc here. Or he's just going to do that crazy kick and give me a massive concussion again. Let's watch tape on this guy. Who the what the fuck are you? You're a, what, he ruined me. And he is a kickboxer. No shit. I kind of figured he was a kickboxer with the way he threw that kick. I want to be sure. Let's see if I can get win this rematch against him. <laughs> <laughs> 